This is my city, Omaha. It's in the center of the United States. And it's made up of all the normal things like buildings, streets, parks, all the things that urban planners and architects dream up. But the city is also made up of the negative space of alleyways where buildings back up to each other. In these narrow corridors, we witness this slow motion interaction of building materials and design concepts, brick and wood, steel and glass. These buildings each represent an era. And the cityscape is constantly shifting and changing, but it takes decades for it to unfold. Structures are built. Retrofitted to meet modern expectations. And eventually demolished. Uh, like us, buildings have relationships in a lifetime. For most people, alleys are out of sight. There are places for delivery trucks and employee entrances. Why else would anyone go there? But they're perfect for hiding things like a garden retreat. Private art galleries. Or piles of garbage from a favorite restaurant. Limited space means filtered sunlight at the end of a tunnel. As twin buildings stand together, or huddle shoulder to shoulder. Of course, alleys are vertical spaces where we can see elevated walkways, skyways, or a burst of blue with frothy white clouds. The French composer Claude Debussy said, music is the space between the notes. And I might adapt this thought to the city. It's not defined so much by the buildings and our intentions, but by the spaces in between. Thank you. <laughs>